Lesson 11. View and Edit PLU Attributes Planners may need to view or edit attributes for the case PLUs. The table view allows the user to quickly view land unit attributes and update attributes for one PLU at a time outside of a land unit editing session. Users can also view and update attributes in the Edit Land Units dialog, which allows users to update attributes for several land units at once. Completing a track reconstitution is one example of when this could be used. The objectives for this lesson are, you will be able to view case POU attributes and edit a single POU attribute in the table view, and you'll view case POU attributes and edit multiple PLU attributes at once in the Edit Land Units dialog. Requirements for this lesson are that the user is logged into Conservation Desktop with a case file with case land units open. First, we will view and edit case PLU attributes in the table view. Click Show Tables to expand the table view. In the table view, select the Case PLUs tab and then select the row for the land unit that needs to be updated. Click the orange Edit button to open the Edit PLU Attributes dialog. The dialog is divided into three tabs, Description, Land Use, and Program. Only the Description tab is available at this time. The others will be included in a later release of Conservation Desktop. Note that if you select a locked land unit, the dialog will open allowing you to view the attributes, but you will not be able to make any changes. Edit the attribute that needs to be updated. In this case, we will add a land unit name. Click Save and Close to save the edits and close the Edit PLU Attributes dialog. At the upper right corner of the table, click on the black circle with a plus sign to show the full list of fields you can display in the table. Check PLU name to add this field to the table. The PLU name entered is now viewable in the table. Click Hide Tables to minimize the table view. Next, we will view and edit Case POU Attributes in the Edit Land Units dialog. If needed, expand the table of contents. Click on the case file name and select Create Edit POUs. In the Edit Land Units dialog, check the checkbox next to the tract that has been reconstituted to select all land units. When multiple POUs are selected, users can update the tract number, HEL status, and land use. The other attributes will be grayed out. Change the tract number to the new number. This will update all selected land units. The asterisk in front of each land unit indicates updates have been made but not yet saved. Click Save and Close to save the changes. Thank you for viewing this lesson for Conservation Desktop Version 2 Release 2.